Yo. You heard it before. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gon' talk, we gon' have fun. We be on fire, we be lit lit. It's a unique hustle, big shit. Big shit, big shit. Big shit. It's a unique hustle, nigga. Big shit. Big shit, big shit, big shit. Name another podcast like this. Who gon' bring it to the table? Boss talk. We your girlfriend favorite. Boss talk. We gon' do it how you want it. Boss talk. Yeah, everybody on it. Boss talk. It's a unique hustle. Check it, check it, check it. It's a unique hustle. It's your boy ECO, and I'm here with the lovely. Amazing official Miss Jamaica. What's going on? Nothing, nothing. You know, my dad walk on. Man, this guy right here, man. Here, this guy from New York, y'all. <laughs> this guy right here know what it is to walk around in cold weather. Yeah. Uh, this guy right here, you know, he don't he don't have no problem telling you that New York pizza is better than Chicago pizza. Of course. This guy right here, he knows how to how to pick certain foods different than you would down here. They be on trucks out there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they, yeah. I'm a country nigga, but I've been out there, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Hey, man. Check it, man. Boss talk. Hey, Sean Martin's in the building. Boss talk. Hey, man. First of all, who who seen that record? That shit kind of fire. <laughs> yo, that record. Yo, that record kind of fire. fire. Everybody, Everybody has that song. Everybody has the same thing. Who's XO up? Music. XO uh, Music. Shout out, I don't know who XO is, but shout out XO to XO Music. XO Music. That hard. shit kind of fire, though. Right. I ain't gonna lie. Everybody got, said the same Mad thing. Mad Max is on the yeah. beat, man. I yeah, put oh, I that went and grabbed a beat, got it to XO. XO came back with a banger. Yeah, that's a banger. I like that. That ain't the first one. She done did about three. Anytime mm. I do something, I get mm. her because I know already she the champ, man. Yeah, yeah. That, oh, that yeah. was a vibe she, right there. And just look up. You'll see us freestyling this whole she went dumb up in there. <laughs> yeah, she'll, she'll, she'll stand up right there where you sitting and, and just go in. That was a vibe. That's man. a show vibe, man. So, man, thank you, man, for coming all the way down here to, to be on Boss Talk 101, man. Thank you for From having New me, York man. to Texas, man. Yeah. Niggas stand up. Who'd have thought? Mm-hmm. Old country boy, man, to have somebody to fly in and just mm-hmm. hang out with him, and yeah. man, just just thank you so much, man. Thank you, thank you for um, having me, man, and um, it's it's an honor just to be here in Dallas, man. And so far, you know, I'm loving the food down here, man. Is this I your did, first time? It's my first time, man. Down here, thank you, you know? for coming, man. Yeah. That's yeah, hard. That food. is first time to yeah. yeah I got some Texas. good food um, down here in Texas. So far, my boy, my boy Bully, he um, straight out of Minneapolis. Um, what have he, you eaten? He, I ate we some. Um, first of all, he put me up on some. Uh, what's it? Oysters, fried, uh, grilled oysters. Grilled oysters. Ooh. Oh my god! Oh, listen, you, you don't have that. Hey, hey, no! Listen, I would not eat no oysters from nowhere. Me either. <laughs> Yeah. But these went in. Oh, my God, bro. Man, I ain't So it lie. wasn't slimy and all that no, since it was grilled? No, it was, it was the seasoning. It was the the cheese in there. It tastes, it was something different. What it don't like even taste like oysters. Grilled. Grilled oysters. Wow. Yeah, the oysters, they was big. And That's hard, stuff. man. Yeah, I, I don't yeah. I got to get different. over there. You got you to show me where that's at. I got you. Fish and fish. Yeah. Yeah. Already. Yeah, Go so, ahead. Yeah. Now, Mr. Jamaica, let's, let's turn into it. So you're born and raised in No, I was uh born, I was actually born in Haiti. In Haiti. I was born in Port-au-Prince, was okay. uh, that's like the capital of Haiti. The capital, and and right. um I was actually raised in um Los Angeles. Oh, how yeah, yeah. old were you when you went to Los Angeles? Um I was like five. So do you remember anything about Haiti? Yeah, yeah, I remember Haiti, yeah. I I'm was just like, asking because I five, oh, a lot yeah. of people don't remember I that. Mean, well, <laughs> I know, know you probably go back and forth, but I'm talking like from the young nah, age. I haven't been since I was a kid, but oh, I, I okay. remember because, um, um, you know, I lost my mother mm. uh, when I was like three, four. Yeah, oh, okay. yeah. So that's how I was able to um, to come here. Yeah, to stay in the states. Okay. Uh, so, you know but your dad was where was from he from California? Oh, okay. yeah, he's from Los Angeles. Okay, so he so was my the, father's okay, side is from Cali- um, what California. What part of California? Los Angeles, South Central, yeah, LA. South Central. But my father's a well-known, um, uh, reputable gangster from the streets. He was like a blood from LA. Really? Yeah, he was a, like a known. Everybody knows him. Everybody knows my father. Do you yeah. mind saying his name, or you can't? They call him Al. Evil Al. Evil Al. Evil Al, everybody knows. Yeah, I'm if running. you ask any, pretty much anybody that's from LA about him, they they gonna tell you about him. Evil Al. Uh, everybody, um, um, I heard like a lot of stories about him, like far as like you know during the death row days. How, yeah, you know he was like, he's like the he was the he was the 
One of them guys. Yeah. And how long yeah. did you stay in L.A.? I grew up there. I grew up in L.A. And um, um, throughout the years, you know, once I got like, um, so I got shot. So I, I've been shot. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yeah. Before you grew before up you, uh, in L.A. Yeah, I grew up in L.A. Yeah. And you and, and your dad was he hard on you or did he? No, how no. Did he, you end up not he, being okay. in the banging. In so the so game? so this I was I I gang, I end up gang banging. But look, okay. so my father was in prison. Okay. For how long? Most of my majority of my life. So he did like let's say I don't know the exact amount of years. So he did let's say 17, 18 years, and then he was only out for three months and got killed. Oh. So hold yeah. on, so hold on, because you moved to LA with him. So before no, no. he, so my, so let me, let me say, so, so I, when I was young, you know, my, my mother and my family came from Haiti. Like we traveled throughout the states. Like right. you know, I was, we was like, I don't, I can't tell you like when I was real young where exactly we lived right. and where we stayed when I was like young. But when we made it to California, you know, um, that's where I, that's that's where my mother. Death. That's where she died. At. Oh, she died in California. Yes. In How LA. did she die? Do you she don't was mind killed. It? She was murdered. Cool. Yeah. So both your parents were was killed. killed execution style. Wow. Yeah. My mother was brutally murdered, like raped, shot, stabbed, all that. Wow. Sorry to hear about yes, that. Yes. You have siblings? Um. Yeah, I got a sibling out here in Dallas. That's one of the part of the reasons why I'm here in Dallas. So that's I your mom. No, my my dad's, your dad's um, daughter. Daughter. Yeah. So wow. I, I got a sister that I haven't met. You know what I'm saying? Like we, we, we older, like, younger. She's younger. Than me. She's younger. Yeah, yeah. But she's she she's a grown woman. <laughs> she was married and stuff like that. So uh, you know, I got a sister on my father's side. We haven't met, and um, I got a um, a brother on my mother's side. He's in Atlanta. Oh, okay. Wow. Yeah. So, okay. but we, we like I say, I'm not close to neither one of them. Like mm -hmm. you know, what I'm saying we like because y'all weren't raised in the same. Exactly. So my my mother was murdered when I was three. So um, me and him, me and my brother got different dads. So boom, he with his dad, you know, his side, and then my sister, she we got different mothers. You say your brother older than you or younger? No, he's younger. He's younger. younger. So we 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 all got different moms and dads and stuff like that. So right. we was not. Close, right. you know, we was all separated type mm -hmm. of shit. You know what I mean? So, I grew up in foster care, pretty much. Mm. Wow, yeah, yeah, I grew up in foster care, and uh, the state took over me. The state, when you, you know, both parents, you know, father in prison, mom gone, and state so you were able over. to get your citizenship as soon as you got here, so, then pretty much yeah. because if because you said soon after your dad went to prison, yeah, he he was already in. when that happened with my mom. I believe he was in prison when that. Yeah, he was in prison when that happened. Yeah. Okay. And I believe him, I believe from my understanding, the reason of that happening to my mom was like a situation where she saw something that she wasn't supposed to see. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? Like, mm -hmm. I, she not have nothing to do. She's Haitian. She don't, she's not even from America. She just was at the wrong place at the wrong, wrong time, time. type of situation. That's what I truly believe like to this day now. Like she was just like a person there and back in them times, it was like no leave no witnesses type of type of situation, mm -hmm. you know, and and, and, and it, you know you just get caught up in a a situation. But, where, but you know, like I could say, man, you know, I'm just happy that we got to meet you. Yeah. Um. And and I know through all of it, you know, it seemed like it's crazy. Mm -hmm. But at the end of the day, for some reason, you still here and you yeah. still got you doing things that people have will never yeah. do in their life. I thought yeah. about that when I was coming mm -hmm. up here. Yeah. Um, just some of the things that you share with mm -hmm. me off the camera. Mm -hmm. The things you're doing are, are even it's things different. that yeah. nobody else yeah. will ever be yeah. able to touch. Yeah. So thank you and, yeah. and, and keep on applying that yeah. pressure as we yeah. get into this interview. But man, you know, to lose a parent, I, I don't have my parents as well, but I got yeah. to spend time with them until I turn 20. Oh, man. You know, but, you know, I mean, when one person think, oh, man, I'm going through it, if somebody out there would worst the case, I think back to shout out to Mayhem, who he's a twin brother, him and his brother twins, and his mom and his dad. His dad was murdered, I believe, at four months old, and his mom before, uh, uh, it may have been mom at four months, and then the dad at like a year, like, and, and they from L.A. Mm. So think about that. Yeah. And they stayed yeah. in, the they never met him, yeah. so they had to, Two identical twins, and it was more of them, but they ended up having yeah. to grow up like that. Yeah, that's crazy. Like, so, uh, yeah, that's. I don't think I tell you that story because yeah. we think sometimes like our story, but there's always somebody oh, yeah, else that most going through worse. Most definitely, and 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 we always got to keep that in mind when we think about ours. Say, man, 
But it's some more people out there that done went through yeah. so much. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. But just um, mm -hmm. man, I commend you, bro. Like yeah. I said, so yeah. when you when did you get into the music? Like when All did right, you so know that you was a like nah, you nah, gonna be a, a rapper? Okay, so so let me tell you, let me tell you. So my father got songs on YouTube. I just found this out. Like what? Yeah, they put them on YouTube. So back in the day, he was rapping. He was rapping. He was like, I'm gonna be real. Was, Al, was that his name on there? Nah, he got songs with his hum I'm, let me explain to you so back in the day I'm gonna be real I'm gonna just be real my dad was a bully okay my dad like in LA everybody my dad was like the like he made Suge Knight pay for like all the bloods uh, TVs in prison like he was like the bully like he, like and then I'm just gonna I'm gonna tell you like he, he like Suge Knight's wife my dad like would like have Teresa? her would have her for like three months four months and he'll give her back to Suge and shit like that really really yeah, so my pops was so like they a, was together, and then he'd just give he'll just give up. It was like I can't explain it, bro. But he ran, it was, he was running thing. Yeah, so well, you got realize yeah, yeah. Suge wasn't no saint. I mean, he had nah, this but, LA, not, he but had you gotta a, understand, like Suge wasn't like you got Suge, but that he was like cool, like doing his thing. But you gotta understand, it was people above him. Of course, you get what I'm saying. Like my yeah. dad, dudes like him. Yeah. Like my father. Yeah. That's you know what I'm all saying? I so so I I remember things when I was kid, like a kid and like certain stuff like you know, and then I got like people right now to this day, like you just have to ask the streets and they'll tell you. You know what yeah. I'm saying? The streets. Well, oh, I tell am you. gonna ask them. I yeah, know people. Just, yeah, just say evil owl dog. They're gonna be like Evil Al Dog. Evil Al. They're gonna tell you just say evil owl. They're gonna be like, Yes. He one of them guys. He is the guy. He is the guy. My pops. It's a true story, based on a true story. Oh, so yeah. like, um, so so basically, what happened with me was, um, you know, I'm from the opposite side with my dad. From my dad was a blood. I come from Hoover, like the oh, Hoover. You Hoover? Yeah, Bobby Johnson, Hoover Deuce. Yeah, that's why I, over there. Boy, you know that, that nigga that showed that movie there, boy. God yeah, yeah, dang yeah. It. So so that's where I'm from. That's where I grew up at. That's where my um, you know, my grandfather got <laughs> when I was young. My my grandfather um got a, a apartment for my mother over there. And uh, on 79th and Hoover, and that's why I kind of came about and uh, stuff like that. And then make a long story short, I just found out my pops rapped, you know, a couple of his uh, um, partners from his hood since showing me like links and stuff on YouTube where my father was rapping. I didn't know where it Let came from. Let me ask from. you something. Is a Hoover yeah. a crib? Well, the five deuces is. You got Hoover's real big. It's a lot of us. It's like eight different cliques of us. It's like eight different extensions. So it's like the five deuce. Originally, we are Crips, yes. But the five deuces are still origi uh, original Crips. The five deuce Hoovers is still original Crips. But you got the five deuces, five, nine, seven, four, eight, trade, nine deuce, nine, four, one, oh, seven, eleven deuce. It's, I got them all tatted right here on my arm too. All of them right here, see. I got them all tatted. All every, the bank, all, I got every all, set, every I got set. every Hoover click on my arm. That's five deuce, five, nine, seven, four, eight, trade, nine deuce, nine, four, one, oh, seven, eleven deuce. I so got when all you them. go to, like, like if you go to jail, they, they start looking at that immediately. It is what it is, man. I'm from where I'm from. And I'm not turning down nothing, and, and it's just what it's gonna be. Wow! So you, you know what I mean? You straight up like, like I'm from where I'm from. That's where so, you so that's your just street. what it is. Yeah, that's what it is. I'm straight. I'm from the streets for sure. So yeah. if a person, do, I gotta ask you this, and I'm glad I'm I got not no you know, I'm not no, no game. I gotta ask you this. I gotta ask you this. Know I mean? gotta ask you this. Yeah. When you was banging? When I was banging, yeah. You don't bang now. That's fine. I've been shot five times for Hoover Street. I, I got Hoover everywhere, tatted, blasted everywhere. I've been I, shot five, five times. Five times. You did work. It's five times. I done, what, oh yeah. When five. you were a Hoover and you was active. Active, yeah. Did y'all respect people from other other states like Texas Hoovers? Well, yeah. I, I got. You I see got, what I'm saying? I got homies from Houston. Hoover's real big in Houston. Like, I don't know what it is in uh, Dallas out here that's but real. Hoover is real big in Houston like you know you got people from the 5th Ward that's from Hoover got people that's part of you know how do you know from, that because I'm from Hoover for real so like what I'm saying is we're real deep so you got people that's really from Houston that's from Hoover that really tap in with LA that go to LA and that's been on Hoover Street they from Houston and they from Texas but they come they come they go they come fuck with niggas in LA so you gotta you got them you got them dudes that's really into the streets bro you got dudes that don't. You got dudes, look, like look, look, look. You got people that's f that care about Hoover that don't care about no nothing else. You got people that care about Hoover more than their own family. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. I'm gonna be real with you. My dad, he was a blood. He he care about blood more than his own kids. He was a die move. That's what he stood on. That's what he died about. That's what he 
everyday living, people don't. That, you got you got dudes that's like that. That's why you can't just became you can't come out here disrespecting people's hoods and communities because people would die for that, bro. Cause that's, that's real. Their you know what I'm saying? That's yeah, real. you know what I'm saying. So you no, can't, no, I get it. You can't you can't you can't be out here doing all of that, bro. People people stand on what they stand on, bro. They don't care about going to jail. They don't care about nothing. They care about Hoover, and they will knock you down for that. For that. Yeah. I, I believe it. Know I, you know, yeah, like, so, so we got you know we got to get into it. Now that's real. So let's talk about the first time you got shot. Where okay, I got shot. At? I got shot in my hood. Every every time I got shot was in my hood. So. I, um, Why in your hood do you think that you'd be protected? I'm six foot nine. Why do you think that you'd be protected <laughs> by the people that around six, six you? Foot nine. Uh, uh, okay. So 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 so. You yeah. ain't six nine. I'm six foot nine. I'm six. I'm six eight and a half. I'm I was six, about to say he don't. Look, he look. Cause he my brothers are six. My brothers are six eight and six nine. I'm six eight and a half. So you in between both of them? <laughs> so you mean to tell me if uh, so? Just imagine this. Okay, so growing up, you know how it was easy for like the dudes on the block to sell work. And get that off or sell weed, whatever they was doing. I can do that shit because I stand out. I'm too damn tall. Exactly. The police see me down the street. Look at this tall motherfucker right here. They, <laughs> they, they, go, they gonna see me. Yeah. So I, it's certain shit that I couldn't do. You know what I'm saying? No. <laughs> that nigga is getting caught every no. time. No. Everybody else get away. Yeah. This big tall nigga trying to run. This That's big him. stupid motherfucker right this here. This nigga know we know it's him. Get this big stupid you probably motherfucker. probably wasn't fast or running. No, no, I'm doing. I, yeah, I, play, I, know, I play college football. Hold on. We're going to play ball. We're going to play ball. Right. That's all so right. I, before, I, before I got shot up, so I, uh, so my first time I got shot, um, I was in my hood. You know what I'm saying? I was How old were you? I, I was like, um, this was like the summer of, uh, this was like, the, I was in high school, but this the summer of when you finished high school. Like it was that okay. summer. Okay. Getting ready to go to college. college yeah. okay. That summer. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. So, um, you know, and I, I and this time, It wasn't for you or it was It for wasn't you? for me. So this one, let me explain to you. So, so what happened was, it's this dude, right? So he come over. He's not from my hood. So he come over. He see his. He see, he go see his baby mama. So I, I see him. You know, he say what's up to me every time. Okay. He not from around here. Boom. One day, one of my homeboys that's not from my hood, he chilling in my he's ch he chilling in my hood with me. He robbed the dude. What? He he robbed the dude right in front of me. So the dude, as a dude getting robbed, he looking at me like, man, you gonna let him rob me? But keep I'm a, I'm a young dude at the time, bro. I'm not in that business, bro. That, that, that ain't got nothing to do with me. He, you getting robbed? That's on you. I, that's how, that's how I was. I'm not about to save you or nothing. So he looking at me like, come on, bro. You see me all the time every day. You letting this nigga rob me? I wasn't looking at it like that. So yeah. he came back shooting. He came back shooting and he shot me. <laughs> Cause you was around that nigga. I was right. He felt like, bro, come on, bro. You, you see me? Stopped it. Yeah, I should have stopped it. Right. Right. Exactly. You could have stopped it. I could have stopped it. But I, I I'm one of them dudes that want to mind my own business. I ain't got nothing to do with that. That's only I'm one of them during the time I was like that. You know what I'm saying? And I, I didn't really have a super personal relationship with this dude. Yeah, I seen him. He go see his baby mom. He was cool. I, that's it. But, you know, but nigga, you, from, you, you ain't, ain't from Hoover. Hoover. You ain't from Hoover. 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 Right. You ain't from Hoover, nigga. You know what I mean? So I'm not about to. That's yeah. Hoover that got you over there. And I know them dudes, Come too. On. So you, know? you didn't see coming. So he came back the very next morning. I'm talking about I got shot. Every time I got shot was in the morning. Oh, bright and early. I got shot like at 7 in the morning. Taking no, out so the you trash. didn't see it. Man, he came in the morning time. So, oh, so you you. Mm. It was seven. How in did the you know it was him? Cause I seen his ass. He come out the window. <laughs> yeah, the Somebody man. was driving. Yes. Ah. I seen him. You like? I seen him. I seen him. It seemed like a movie. Yeah, huh? yeah, yeah, it was like a movie. I got shot right here in the shoulder. I can show y'all, but I got a bullet. You can see it's kind of like sticking out my back right here. So it came but, out. So no, the first time I got shot was right here through my. Right here, do my shoulder, boom, and, and it came you out. You, you went to the doctor. Went to the hospital, and I got checked out. And the homie uh, discharged me the same day. It didn't hit no vital organ. No, thank God. Thank God. And then that was that one time. That was that was. Did I you got see shot him again after that? Hell no, he ain't never came back around. He, his his baby mama moved out. <laughs> Everything they left. They Hell knew what yeah, time it was. Left. They yeah, knew what time it was. Oh stuff. no, they knew what time it was. He like, nah, I ain't even about to play play with these little hoover niggas over here. He, <laughs> let's get let's get this. But he came back like he supposed to. Yeah, almost that. I he came back. It. Yeah, he, he had to come back. I respect it. I respect so it. what they robbing for though? Do you know? Some bullshit, a wallet. That's what I'm money. saying. Like some nothing, money. miscellaneous. Yeah, was, some dumb. He was just coming over to see his baby mama regular shit. 
So as he getting robbed, the homie like, nigga, you know, you know, give me your wallet, check your pockets, checking his pockets. I'm sitting there looking like, damn, he, you know what I mean? Like he dropping the shit out this thing. You know what I'm saying? I'm looking like, damn. Did he shoot that yeah. nigga too? No, he he wasn't around. You know what I'm saying? So he just got the, you. The homie that was robbing him ain't from Hoover. He was just a homie that oh, my, my you should have stopped it, bro. You yeah, were wrong. Yeah, yeah. You knew you were wrong afterwards. But the homie that was robbing him, he was like older than me. You know what I'm saying? I was cool with him. You know, I kind of looked up to him. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. I, I didn't really I could have been like Come on man I know dude You know It was just like A tight situation So I didn't I didn't I didn't I didn't I didn't, I didn't Yeah I didn't I didn't get you involved You learned your lesson From it though Yeah I learned a lesson so I learned a hell of a give lesson Give me the next time You guys shot Also boom That was that first time Boom the second time This Now now the second time Was all in one You know what I'm saying So I got shot one time One one shot Boom straight through and The second time I got shot four times Whoa Yeah I almost died this time You 50 cent round this hoe I almost died this time You something like 50 yeah. Close range? Yeah. No. I don't even know who shot. So this is what happened was that the uh the second time I was um I went out to a um what do y'all call like a um like a um damn, like and this a little, one was meant for you like this time. What do y'all call like out here in Dallas? You know how y'all got like the you, you know everybody got them like they little hole in wall places where like the OG places like they play like they can bet like gamble and shit yeah, like yeah, that yeah 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 you that's, know what I'm saying you, you know can what I'm do that about? strip club too but you, but they got I've like seen this they like the old like ghetto club. club yeah like no yeah. It, it, it don't even gotta be a club no, it no, just no. be like a little spot no, where they, yeah, they just got a pool there they call it a club it ain't okay, no club okay okay okay, okay. you know what I'm saying one, like one a hole in the wall side show yeah I don't know what y'all call it out here it's just a hole in the wall but it's it's definitely a little old just a little knock off a uh, uh, club, but it's not a club. People just go there to hang out, shoot okay, pool, yeah, that's, that's, shoot dice, yeah, whatever so, you want to so, do over there. So, 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 boom! I, I, I go out to this little spot in Inglewood, California. I go to this little hole in the wall, little club. Boom, boom, boom. We have a crazy night. Boom. Anyway, I, I, I step. I'm like, yo, I'm about to go say peace out. So, um, it was like probably like around like three or four in the morning. So, like, we just left this little hole in the wall spot. So I said, like, I'm gonna say uh, stop by. I'm in the turf. Say what's up to people. Say good night. Close when I so make a long story short. I'm walking out the. I'm walking out this. I'm walking out the little spot. Boom. In my hood. I'm walking out this little spot in my hood. Soon as I walk out, like it was like a movie. So keep in mind, it was a shell catcher, a, a shell catcher, and a silencer. So I was getting hit. So imagine getting hit four times, maybe like in the four in the morning, three, four in the morning, whatever time it was, and you just and you just getting hit. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, nobody like can. A, a nigga next to you can't even hear you getting hit. Yeah, like you just getting hit. You know, you know what they remind me of you know that movie saying? where Will Smith and his son, his son was after him. What was that movie? Huh? Gemini. Yeah, yeah, no, ain't that right? Yeah. When you get hit on that bike, you can hear the bike, but then you can hear the guns. Yeah. yeah. So when I was getting hit, I'm crawling, and niggas was like, "What the f like the so so I I so it's a it's a crazy story." So I crawl, I dial nine one one for my phone. Hell yeah! I'm like, "Yo, I'm hit. I'm on Woo in Vermont Avenue. That's in LA, South Central LA. I'm on Woo in Vermont Avenue." So my homies, my homies wasn't thinking. My homies, they, you know, my one. I ain't gonna lie, one of my homies. Got back cracking, busting, boom, boom, boom on the on the car that you know shot at. Yeah, me. yeah hell you know yeah. I mean? So I'm I'm on the ground looking as the homie just shooting at the car. Like I'm just looking like, but I'm shot the fuck up. But I'm looking. I'm still aware. I'm I'm drunk too. Thank God I was drunk too. Yeah, because you didn't really. Feel yeah, that. yeah, I didn't. I, didn't. I thank God I was drinking. That's yeah. why I drink to this day. Yeah, so you didn't feel no bullets. Blame it on anything no, you no, can. No, no, no. <laughs> I didn't know that either. That's why I drank to this day. Nah, nigga. You was drinking because you like to drink. Yeah, nigga. I like to drink. <laughs> but I, I was drinking and, and, and think, it, it kept me calm. You know what I'm saying? You're supposed to stay calm. It, it, was, it kept me calm flow, and it kept me, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? So, um, so boom. So then I'm like, okay, so my homies, they carry me and put me in the car. So I'm waiting for the paramedics. The home. So when they put me in their car, the car got put for um, what you call it for uh, evidence? Evidence. There you have it. Evidence for evidence. So they had to take their car. So I'm like, damn, bro. Like you know, my bad. You know, what I mean, I didn't mean to get your car took and shit like that. So you know, they put me in the car. How did they and, stop you from bleeding out? They held pressure on the on the bullet. But I'm gonna be. I was so fucked up. I ain't gonna lie. I, I was fucked he up. Don't know. I don't even really. I, I have to ask them niggas. You know they what I'm saying? Keep pressure on I have them. to ask them. They say they say my where life. Where all did you get shot? Four times. Oh, where shit. did you get shot? I got shot. I got a bullet right here in my back. Right here. Okay. Smoking right there. Got shot right here. Twice in my ankle. Yeah. That's I four. Shot. I got one, two, like one and two, like right here. They right here. One. Yeah, that comes on two, the side of your heart. Three, four. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. Uh, in my ankle. 
I got I got I got three metal plates on my ankle. So if I like took them, you'd be like, damn, my ankle's like you can see. Yeah, ain't gonna mess three, up. Messed yeah. out. Three so, metal plates on my ankle. So, so I've been shot five times. And you just said and, and you when you went to the hospital, how long did you stay in the hospital? Like Two months, maybe. Two months. They had yeah. to get you right. Because I was you. in a wheelchair. Yeah, you had to learn I how to walk, walk again and all that. that. Shit. So what happened was when... Well, no, so, well, so let me real quick, real quick. I got to tell this. you this. I got to Go say ahead, this before man. you. So when I got shot up, I prayed a lot. I'm going to be hey, real shit. Let me tell you something. You got to. Let me tell you something. I never prayed like this. I never had a... I'm going to be real. I, I believe in God and I always felt like I had a relationship with God. But this last time when I got shot, I was really... I could have died, but I can't explain to you, bro. It was just like a a, a, a a relationship I had with God, and I was talking to God like every day when I was in the hospital. Yeah. And then I felt like God was kind of like telling me, you know, that's why when I see a handicapped person, I'm a type of person that helped the person, the handicapped person. If I see somebody in a wheelchair, I'll be the first one to open the door, help yeah, them move. Yeah. Because when I was in the hospital, they had me on a lot of medication yeah. that I, I had, like I couldn't shit for like a week yeah. or two or some Watch shit like that. Bad. So I was taking medication and when I shit, it was like a whole bed full of shit, right? Yeah, yeah. But when I couldn't even wipe my own ass and that, like I'm being real with you. So the oh nurse God. had to clean me and I was just used to crying. The nurse be like, yo, it's okay. And I'm just sitting there just like, Helpless, and I just like damn. I felt like God was telling me like, you see how I feel to not like able to you know do for y'all like 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 it, it was something I was just experiencing. Hard, like bro. I can't explain it. Like no. it was like kind of like you know help help somebody when help is needed. Like I was like really like crying, and the nurse was like, yo, you don't have to keep crying like this because I was just tears just coming out because I was like embarrassed. Let me tell you something. You know man. what I'm saying? Like everybody like go through their three days of dying. You know what I mean? Come down to meeting God to understand and how to. It's a three yeah. day of dying, meaning like Jesus went through. Anybody go through something, you get trying to get to something. So that link right there is unexplainable. Yeah, like, I like, can't explain. You know okay, so saying? so when I did that, when I was in the hospital, I wrote my song called Ben. If you pull up my song, if you look up Alshon Martin Band. So my shout out to my brother Solo Lucci from uh, Fourth Ward, Texas. This this how this how everything he happened. Did over here, Solo no, but Lucci. it doesn't matter. I'm about to That's tell you what Solo right. Lucci happened. This is how everything happened for me. Solo Lucci. I was in my hood. Solo Lucci was living in LA during the time. This is when he was on Love and Hip Hop and all yeah, that shit, right? Yeah. So he was living in LA. So, you know, Solo Lucci from Fourth Ward, he he gave me some money. I said, I said, I said, bro, I just got out the hospital. I just started back walking. I, I met up with so I met Solo Lucci. And I told him nigga, I'm from Hoover. Ooh, he's not from Fourth Ward. And we, we was in LA. Right? So for Lucci he was like Crip too. Yeah, Crip too. Exactly. So I said this. He was in my hood with me. I brought him to Hoover Street with me. This is when I just recovered and everything. So I said, yo, bro, I'm trying to do this rap shit. I wrote a song while I was shot up in the hospital. I said, bro, I want to shoot the video in my hood. I, I nigga, I ain't gonna lie, man. I felt like the when I got shot, I was like, bro, I'm about to do this rap shit. Because I felt like my story was so real and everything. Like, I was in the trenches. Like, I said, I got to do it. You, you know? Do. Yeah. So what happened was, Lucci gave me about a couple thousand dollars off the strength. Like, here, bro, shot me a couple thousand. With that couple thousand dollars, I threw World Star Hip Hop, like a thousand, to throw my video on World Star. I shot the video for maybe like $900. Like, I only had a He gave me a couple racks, right? I, I, I made everything happen with, with them couple racks Lucci gave me. And I shot the video in my hood, threw the video on World Star. When I threw the video on World Star, so shout out to World Star Hip Hop for this. Takashi Six Nine just came out in the hood with my Billy niggas and my Hoover niggas. You know, he had that shit, that gummo shit. Yeah, yeah. And it was going crazy. So when he did that, my video was on World Star, and me being from Hoover, he had a song in the hood with my Billy niggas and my Hoover niggas. So it was like on top of World Star. It just looked at like you. Need, so when he hit, when I we was on this one, Instagram was just yeah, barely, yeah, just barely taking off. You know what I mean? So I'm like, yeah, he like, yo, you from Hoover, man? Like, you hard. So every since then, he, he hit you up. I hit, I hit him up. You hit him up. Cause I was like, nigga, when he said in the hood with my Billy niggas and my Hoover niggas, I'm like, ooh, you like? And it, it was lit. Yeah, yeah, so I yeah. Hit him up. And, and my video was up on World Star next to his. And he liked. He and so he seen it, and then he like, oh, like he like, nigga. And then he flew me out to New York. And ever since then, we was like this. I lived with him. I lived with six nine and his baby mama, his daughter. Um, all Wait that. a minute. Yeah. Wait a minute. Cause six nine. <laughs> yeah, this six, one he was nine, lit. This yeah. one he was really really. This lit. is when he was before like before he got busted. This is when he first started going something? up. This is when I don't care who you want to name Drake, Nicki. I don't care who you. That 6 9 had the biggest year of hip hop that you could ever. He went like 13 for 13 on Billboard. Like everything he dropped went Billboard. Like and everything. You was with that him. one year that I was with him. That whole year. Before he went to jail, 
He had the biggest year of any well, artist. How did ever you had. end up not being one of those guys that got caught up? Because I'm not a blood, and I'm not from New York. You gotta understand. Look, I, 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 he's, I, I'm, 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 I'm from the blue side of things. Like I came out to New York. You know what I'm saying? And I was on my rap shit, just music shit. I wasn't involved in the the, 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 the fuckery. Now. I'm out from South Central LA. I, I'm out here trying to, nigga, I just got shot five times, nigga. I'm out here chasing a, uh, some rap shit. You niggas so, out here trying to uh, do some dumb ass shit. I'm happy to make it out my situation. So you know you what I'm see, saying? Like type but shit. You, 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 did you guys even do any project together? Yeah, we was working on a lot of music. Like a lot of the, some of the songs he got, he went Billboard for. You know what I'm saying? I was just learning the music shit. Like some of the shit and I don't even want to care about, but I helped him like write some of the songs and that went number one like what? Uh, 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 Tati like I helped Tati. him Tati uh, that's a song called Tati yeah you know what I'm saying I like a couple songs and it's a lot of songs we was working on that's in the studio like me and him like it just never had to I, he was on fire you know what I'm saying so yeah. it wasn't like when you next to a person that's on fire like how he was on fire it, you gotta let them do their thing and then once it's time for you to do your thing it's like you just gotta stay next to that fire so you know what I'm saying you, when shit. everything when the baby mom and all of them the drama right started there. when everybody when when, the, when he got I picked there. up you, I, was, I was I was I lived with him when you when he got picked up or when this stuff started to fall all apart shit, where was you at I was at, so when, when when a lot of shit happened I, I'm gonna be real with you, I was in the studio like 92% of the time I was working in the studio like a lot of shit he, sometimes he'll leave and I wouldn't even be with him but I'll be in the studio. Like I'm talking about, as far as like lead a country, he might. I might not even go with him overseas real quick. I might be in the studio for a month, like recording. Have you seen him since he got? Yeah, out? yeah. I just seen him recently. Yep, I saw really? him in Miami. I was so, busting. So Rhymes. you still, you and him still have a relationship. Man, me and him is tight forever, bro. You'll never forget. I, his mom, his mom is like, I love his mom. That's bro. hard. You know what I mean? mean? Like, so what do like you his think? His daughter is like, I, like, like I, this nigga. His daughter, like, it's, I'm around. Or anybody that I'm close to, like, if you like, you see him, I'm I'm literally with his family. Yeah, but I'm asking. Like, I'm just like, saying, like, no, I'm just trying I to get tell it. you. I like, get I don't, it. I don't have like. Cool relationships, like it's like nigga, we family. We family. Like if I fuck with you, nigga, I'm around, I'm around your kids. Yeah, I'm around you, my kids. Like you know, we we like that's how a no, heart. That's, that's hard. just how I you am. Got a good heart. No, you got a good no, heart. It ain't no nigga like we kind of cool type shit with me. But, nigga, like if you don't fuck with me, you you, you got to know me personally. Like so, you got to know like type of shit. So whatever come yeah. with the with with the fact of how people feel about six nine, you got to ride with that because yeah. that's your boy. But that's my boy. But all that snitching and doing all that, like my whole thing is this. Look, bro, I come from the land where you all that snitch and shit don't fly fly with me. Where I come from, you know what I'm saying? I'm from South Central, so like that shit doesn't rock with where I come so from. How but you but but you know he's not like that. You know what I'm saying? He's not a game. Like, he's not a... He was a, a pedestrian that they turned and they try to make them... Look, my whole thing is this. Y'all But I got a question because go I know that um, with yeah. L.A. gang business and stuff like that, if you even hang out with someone who is a snitch, yeah. they, they, they cut label you off, they yeah. label you, they, they all sorts of stuff snitch. about you. Yeah, but it's, it's, it's like I say, at the end of the day... So how's he's not that a gang happen? member. You know has that he's happened like, to you? If no, no, if if it happens to so me, so you get excluded if you're not a gang member. Yeah, you're not a gang member. Thank you. Somebody need to know that out there. If, if you're, you're not, not a gang a member, <laughs> then you can't be a snitch, nah. and you ain't in the game with that. Yeah, I ain't you don't not, call no names, but listen, man, please. Listen, if you give a, me a, a break a, here, a, a regular pedestrian next door, the people that own this motherfucker next door, they tell on some shit. You can't be like, oh, they told man, they supposed to tell. Them people don't. They not from the. They out here. They got businesses and they got families. They not in you the streets. That? They got businesses. They got family. They not in the streets. I got. Yeah, yeah, I'm somebody talking about need to hear that, niggas. Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> somebody need to hear that because it's a lot of people that label you just because you on a podcast or, or because you interview people, man, why you interview him? Man, you a snitch. Why you inter... It's not like that, bro. Yeah, I'm not in that. your game. Yeah, I don't right, know right. your rules, Yo, your rules yeah, right, right. You know what I'm, I'm not in your game. Yeah. So, just... Um, yeah, that, 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 that but, shit is kind of like... I think they need to do like a... A new, a new, uh, like a setting for when it comes to snitching. People need to understand different. It's, it's snitches, like, and then there's not snitches, and there's people that's gonna tell because that's what they're gonna do, bro. But do you? Okay, so as you, did you get to meet like Nikki or any of those? Yeah, I've been around everybody. Uh, so when I um, 
Jay Z. I met Jay. I mean, we met Ho. You met Jay Z. Yep, I got to chill. I got to meet. How was that? Because you know, I be on Jay Z hard on this channel. Like yeah. I'm in the south, so I be yeah. like Jay Z that took Ho. our girl. You know, it was tight. took it her was, back was, to New York. No. <laughs> we uh, love Beyonce. So, so that's why I got the New York. And I'm gonna tell you, that's so, hard. Um, excuse me. Um, I met Ho in L. A. When I was with Six Nine, and I was with all Brooklyn niggas. And um, Jay Z thought I was from New York. He thought I was from New York. He like, yo. I'm like, nah, I'm from LA. He like, you from LA? I'm like, yeah, he like, man, watch out. He told me to watch out. He like, he tell me personally, he said, man, watch, you know, have his back. Watch out for myself to hold. I said, man, I will, man, I got him. He was just like, I'm like, I'm like, he like, and he looked at me and he could tell, like, he was like, man, you a real one. Like, he like, that's why he, cause we was in LA. And he was like, so you the reason why he out here comfortable, like in LA. I'm like, yeah, like I got him. Cause I, it was like that because when I was in New York, they had me. Yeah, that's real. So it wasn't like no gang shit. It was just like, nigga, when I was in New York, I was with them. And when they in LA, they with me. Like, it wasn't no, like, crip blood shit, nothing. Yeah. <coughs> it's was, it was the family. Yeah. That family thing you had going yeah, so, on. So, so, um, Hove was cool. I met his daughter, Ivory, and shit like that. That's crazy. And she was little. She was young during the time. She probably bigger now, but, um, Hove was real cool, man. That was one. Hove was my. That's who I look up to. Like all these people, like everybody. I'm like a Jay Z, and a, like I, I want to move like Hove. Like I want to. Like I'm like a. As you see in the video, I got with Rick Ross. Like the bosses. Like I like the bosses, bro. Like yeah. I like the bosses. Like that. And Rick Ross. Them cool, the dudes cool I like. With, he you know cool I mean? with Jay Z too. Of course, of course. Of so course. y'all got a little, old, uh, yeah. little old private uh, friendship. Man, I, I'm going. about to get. I'm about to get with them, man. I'm about to get with them. <laughs> I'm about to get with them. So I'm about to get with them. <laughs> that's right. I'm about to get with that's them. That's the money team. That's, 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 that's it. That's why I, all y'all talk about this now. I want to be like Hove and Rose and all them. <laughs> I don't care about all that young nigga stupid shit. Y'all out here trying to them. You don't hear about them niggas getting caught up in no dumb shit. They moved the right way. You better move like Hove, man. I'm telling you. So now I'm trying to. I'm just saying. No, I get you. Know it, what man. I mean? So yeah. being being from uh, okay. So be, so so I've been in New York ever since. So I, I live in New York. How long you been in New York? Like seven years. Seven years. So that's why I, I, I kind of like New York. So my first time ever being on a radio station was New York, High 97. Shout out to High 97, Drewski, and everybody down there at High 97. My first time on a radio station, High 97. My first time everybody embracing me, New York. Like, so that's why, like, New York is, like, really, like, my home now. Like, yeah, I'm from L.A. Even when you hear my music and my approach, even my style. You ain't been on style, L.A. platform? Nah, L.A., I, I just don't got no... L.A. is just not... It's not like... It's what... I feel like LA was a chapter I just grew up in. I feel like New York is like, kind of like stamp me. And you kinda, like New York? I'm more of a New York. They embrace of, you. Yeah, I got love. They bra- okay, so I got love. <laughs> you said Busta Rhymes a while ago. How's, oh, Busta how's, Rhyme. how's Busta Rhymes? Oh yeah, like? Busta. Uh, that shout out to my sh- shout out to my big bro Busta. That's what I'm trying to tell you. New York is like my wave, bro. Like I, New- I don't know. Just like I just love. How New did York. you meet Busta Rhymes? Through my um my manager special. That's just him and Buster Rhymes was best friends since they was kids. Like they went to they, they, him and Special. Everybody knows Special. You just say Special. Everybody. Say man, Buster Rhymes yeah. a different type of nigga when it comes to energy. Man, Buster's a Did real. Did you hear what one, I just man. said? Buster's a real. The one. energy. Yeah, a real. One. I ain't never seen nobody that kind of energy. Man, no nigga can do energy man. like this. <laughs> no nigga, you know it too. If the, you turn the lights on and turn the music on, I never been in a room with this nigga. I would want to be in the room with him just because of his energy. Yeah, and they was doing that versus shit. Nobody didn't want to do no versus. Nobody wanted to do that nigga energy different. <laughs> Niggas don't want to do no. But everybody know that though. Chill out. He don't even want no. Nobody don't even want to come behind him when they rapping. Yes, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's please. get him, get him, get him right. <laughs> but, but yeah, yeah nobody. But, but man, first of all, man, shout out to, man to Boss Talk. Yes, hell That's what yeah. I'm saying, I'm saying. Shout out to Boss Talk, bro. One hundred and one. Shout out to Boss Talk. I had to come down. I'm in Dallas. That's hard. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm loving Dallas right now. I'm actually talking to my brother. My brother. Uh, Bully right here, you know. My brother got his own car rental shit going on out here, um, and he and he building. He actually do music too, um, so you know we just building and coming with a master plan outside of just music, bro. Expanding me outside of music, like bro, that's cool. We're not just thinking one dimensional. We thinking about owning shit, businesses and stuff like that, and that's what we talking about before I even. Um, you know, came on. He's like, bro, start. Th- bro, you, you want to be a boss, bro. That word, boss, talk. Boss, talk, one on one. Boss is the key word, bro. You know what I'm saying? And that's what you want to become. 
Well, that's, not, that's a good. That's a that, that's a great note to bring yeah. up. Yeah. Uh, this Rick Ross uh, yeah. and you, y'all yeah. do a video together. We shot it at How the do you land. even yeah. link with Rick Ross? Mm -hmm. How do you even make that make that connection? Shout out to my brother G to K out the Bronx, man. Shout out to my brother G to K out the Bronx. Jada Kiss, nigga. No, that's my nigga. Oh, shout out to Jada Kiss too. What nigga, you mean? Jada Kiss, Jada. me. Come on. Shout out to Kiss. You know we on the wall yeah. over there, Kiss of Death, man. Yeah, come the on, hardest rap I ever heard. Rap out of the East Coast. Ain't nobody touching it except for, of course, Rock. Him and, mm -hmm. it, and my boy, uh, shout out to Eric Sherman. I love Eric Sherman. So but yeah, go ahead. Uh, my 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 big bro Jeter K. Um, him and Ross is like brothers, pretty much. Really? Yeah, Jeter K out the Bronx, and then my uncle. I got an uncle that's been down thirty five years. He, my, he he. I uh, talk to him uh, every day. Uh, what's the name, brother? He's my my dad. What's your brother name? My I dad. Mean your dad name? Evil Al. Evil Al. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So so they call him Bo. Ooh. They call him Bolo. Bolo out the Nickerson Garden Projects. The Nickerson Gardens is the biggest projects out of Watts, that's, California. That's Bounty Hunter BJ. Bounty Hunters. He been on here. Nah, but my uncle is is Bounty Hunters. Listen, let me tell you. My uncle's name is Bolo. He's He's been down 35 years. Bolo. I, I talked to him. I, I would call him right now. I talked to him while he's in prison right now. 30, he, he runs everything. Like he, He's a blood out of Bounty Hunter Nickerson Gardens. My uncle. Mm -hmm. Really? Multiple murders and stuff like that. He's been down for 35 years. Yeah, yeah. That, so that's Bonnie Hunter BJ yes. who's been on this show. They all link because he's from okay, Nickerson. Well, he, as well. he know who Bolo is. He know who, he know who Bolo, Bolo is. is. So if you say Bolo, he gonna know who he is. Yeah, he gonna, he gonna, he gonna ask about him. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm gonna ask you. so yeah, so my I'm uncle, my uncle, he when it comes to this Don Moose stuff, he really tapped in <coughs> everywhere worldwide. So Jeter K is a Don Moose out of the Bronx. So my uncle. You know, when you do, when you have dudes that's been down 35, 36 years, you don't, you don't know how much, you don't know how much knowledge and how many connections and how, who they done helped out or how many family members they done connect. It's just a lot of just connections, right? So a person that's been down, just imagine a person that's been down 35 years. 35 years. 35 Will years. Will he ever get out? He's trying to, man. He's trying to. Yeah. So he's been down 35 years. Bolo. Bolo, yep. So he um, connected me with Jeter, who's next to Ross. So I already had the relationship. So he connected you with Man, listen, Jeter. I had a song with Schoolboy Q out of, with Kendrick Lamar. Yeah, school so the Schoolboy Q's from my hood, right? Fado's Hoover. But he signed to Top Dog, which is from Bounty Hunter. That's right. Niggas and Guards, right? He signed to Top Dog. So I had a song with um, Schoolboy Q. Schoolboy Q from my hood. I couldn't get the song clear. So I tell my uncle that's locked up down there. Man, uncle, man, I got a song with Schoolboy Q. I'm trying to get this song clear. He said, what? He signed to my little homie, um, Top Dog. He called Top Dog on the phone. I'm on the phone with my uncle and Top Dog. Hey, you know who this son is? This Eve Wow son. What? Oh, yeah. You need the song cleared? I swear to God on my life, song cleared the next day. I had the song. I did the song probably like. Eve Wow from the grave. He's speaking from the grave right now. I swear to God. You know what I'm saying? Eve speaking from the grave right now. I did the song. Probably like a year. It's been, I couldn't get the song clear for. I couldn't get in touch with Top Dog. They two way up there. I, I'm like, man, I'm trying to get us up top. So my That's uncle like, crazy. why didn't tell me? I said, man, he like, I, man, I swear the next day my song got clear. Shout out to Bolo Man from Boss Talk One Hundred One <laughs> for calling them shots, nigga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So my uncle got that shit clear for me, and uh, you know, you know, Schoolboy Q. My, from, shout out to my big bro, Schoolboy Q. Always been like a, a big brother to me, and, and he, he he's the person that I I look up to. Uh, Cause he comes from my community. Man, that's and a shit hell of like a that. connect. So, yeah. so you get with your with, with the with Bolo and Bolo hook you up my with uncle. your your with your your with uncle Ross. Bolo. He hook you up with Ross with pretty Jeter. much. With so Jeter. Jeter, so so my, I was signed to a label called Legacy Records during the okay. time. So I already had the connection with Ross. So all I need them to do is like, hey man, listen, I got a situation with Ross. I need to put up this money for this, and we're gonna shoot the video. I'm going to his house. They're like, oh, you want to Ross house? Yeah, I'm going to the Promised Land. We about to shoot it there. Who picked it? He told you he could come on down. Yeah. I, like, come had, on. I had the relationship Like you know it Can't nobody just Come to Ross house No you did though. You know what I'm saying like, <laughs> you, <laughs> shit. you know what I'm saying yeah. You did though yeah. You know what I'm saying yeah, so, I had so when a, you get to yeah. Ross house what, yeah. what is it like Cause Man, you know The bar got a big, big house like, down there ha Have you seen the movie uh, Have y'all seen the movie Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory yeah. <laughs> Hey, this thing got like a hundred rooms. I swear to God, yeah. It was like every room was some new shit. Like I'm like, God damn. You know what I'm saying? Like it was like it was like that, bro. I swear to God, it was like I was trapped in Willy Wonka and the chocolate factory. You bro, I swear to God, I was like, what the fuck is this? This thing had a, a fucking room with like every video game in the world. 
Yo, this nigga had a room with every old video game there ever is. And he probably ain't been every, in the room, some of them yeah, rooms. He can't be going, going in all them rooms. He has a like, bowling it's alley. It's all old video bro. games, not the new ones, bro, the old ones. Yeah, the old, old ones. ones. The old ones, collector's yes. items. Yes. That's good. Yes, every old one. That's hard. Every, That's hard. bro, every one, bro. <laughs> I heard he got a lot of art in there too. I talked bro, to a guy. I, I, bro, he had like a hundred and something rooms, bro. I don't. I didn't even. Get to... <laughs> I didn't get to look at the art, nigga. Bro, I, I thought it was, too, it was too... the art. It's like, bro, like, bro, like, seriously, bro. And then I'm like, dang, you know, it's just like, yeah, the bowling alley in there. I'm getting dressed in the house. I'm like, dang, I'm just like, nigga, it's so much. But how? I looked at the video, which of course it ain't came out yeah. yet. But I looked at the video, dope video. Mm -hmm. I can't wait till it come out. Me but neither. it looked like the the, all, the girls was there. Everything. They was couldn't believe it, shit. <laughs> <laughs> so, like, how do you pick? Shit. Like, did he just tell you we want to set up right here and do it, or how, who Man, picked? Where y'all set up? Jeter, Jeter, and that whole act like he already been there before. And yeah. oh, we gonna go right yeah. here, and we gonna be in yeah. here, and we want to do it right yeah. here. Yeah. You know, it really takes a nigga to act like he know what he yeah. doing. You really don't know what you're doing. I'm walking in the hole saying I want to set up right here. This is gonna be perfect. Uh, it Jeter. might not be perfect to you, but to me. This is the perfect location for us to shoot this shot and bring the girls right here. Mm -hmm. That nigga gonna say, that nigga show up. <laughs> yeah, man. It's all yeah. about your heart, man. It is, it is. And, and, and I bring that, like, every time. And I didn't even get into the talk about Wyclef John and how, like, Wyclef is, like, my uncle. Like, I didn't even... We didn't even get into that yet. Wyclef the legend. Like, you got my songs with him, too, right? And I got, like... I can, I'm gonna let you hear I got like 10 First of all I got like 10 unreleased songs with him I got a song right now On all streaming platforms On his biggest pro, On his last record called, I mean his last project Called Why Clef Goes Back to School We got a song called 420 That's the biggest song On that project um, And we was actually um, um, Cat Williams was supposed To direct the video And um, I had a, I had put Cat Williams And Why Clef On a three way call And it was Oh man I had recorded it That shit what was so happened? funny but um, Cat Williams was supposed to direct the video, and then um, man, Cat Williams is real life funny, bro. Like, he's why like, would you? He's really Cat, why would Cat Williams direct the video? Is he really a director? But I don't know. You know, I get the craziest stories on here from yeah. Cat Williams. Like yeah. now, all of a sudden, he's a director. Now, now come no, on, I want to hear this. The song is called Four Twenty, and I, I don't know. I don't know why Uncle Cliff was like, "Yo, let's just." Have Cat Williams like call Cat Williams because he like to smoke. Yeah, I guess I don't know. That's probably what it is. But, yeah, but, but he was Cat. Cat said he was in Haiti with Clef. That's so right. They got history. They got history. And he said, you know what? They got history. Next video, I don't care what it is. <laughs> I'm gonna let you direct it. He like, man, I ain't never direct no damn. Video. <laughs> 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 and Cat just yeah. said, I'm gonna take off with it. Yeah, Cat was like, yeah, and it was all <laughs> excuse Bro. me, they was, was all with it. And then next thing you know, Cat Williams just fell off the planet of Earth from big court. To Faze on Love, who's been on my show, they both had crazy stories about Cat Williams. But both mm -hmm. of them said he was super, uh, uh, that he had a good heart, man. Yeah, that he'll he tried give to you help everything. you. He'll give you the shirt Can off the back. Can I tell you back. something? He, 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 like, I had, I made the call. I forgot how I even got Cat Williams' number because Clef didn't even have Clef, Cat Williams' number. I got Cat Williams' number, and Cat Williams don't even know me, but I got his number. I forgot who I got it from, but I had his number. So when I called, when I called, I told, I called um, Cat Williams. I said, hey, I'm about to put you on a, he don't even know who I am. I said, hey, I'm about to put you on a call with Why Clef John. He like, oh, yeah, yeah, he was like with it. So I called Uncle Clef. I said, I'm about to call Cat Williams. I got his number. He like, okay, uh, Uncle Clef, like, yeah, call him, call him. So they got to talk, and I, I so I put him on a three-way, and I just set the phone right there, and I recorded on my other phone. Because it was so funny. Cause yeah, a, they were true. Because they was just talking to each other. Like, I didn't know they, they had history with each other. Like, they had mad history. Like, he... Cat was talking about like how much he loved Haiti and you know he want to go back and they you know they was out in Haiti That's doing hard, their thing man. and shit like that yeah it's yeah hard, bro yeah yeah so we I, and then so Uncle Clef was explaining to him like yeah we got this song called 420 we went to so I'm excited like yeah the cat we was about to direct it direct this whole you know we about to, he ain't you know, been like, directing nothing before <laughs> this is high all I'm high. I know a high moment. This is a high moment. These all three high niggas come out. We gonna go and let you be the director. Boy, nigga come up yeah. with some stuff when he's smoking. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? 
Mm-hmm. So I, that's hard though because yeah, that's, that's that's dope that you could bring people. You could come together with people. I'm like good that. at that. I'm good at it's that. Same one that way. Thing, one thing about me that's and, and I'm a, I'm more like I'm an artist, but I'm more like on some A and R type. Like I'm more I'm more like I'm a good person to get people to connect. Like I, I know how to get people like to fuck with each other. Yeah, that's that you good. Even think like that. And, and, and I'll be the person that did it. Link them up. <laughs> yeah, I'm wow. really good at that. I'm wow, really good at that's that. That's hard, man. So you I like doing that. I like you doing basically. What I'm gonna go back to Rick Ross's exactly. house. Oh yeah. Got to go back because you can't just leave that. That promised got, land. The promised land was hard, man. So mm-hmm. how how many tape? How many scenes did y'all do in that thing? Damn, it was like an all. That day treatment day. was different. It was an all day. We, we yeah. <laughs> excuse me. It was like a um. And uh, y'all were dressed to impress too. Yeah, yeah. All, all my and that's all my jewelry. Like none, none of that shit rented. Like all my shit is me. Yeah. None of that, we and shout out to my shout out to my label for that because they like yo. We got to make sure you, you know, when you're doing songs with these artists like Ross and shit like that, you can't come. Half step. Yeah, in. you got to come correct. You can't mm-hmm. do that fake shit. You can't, you know what I mean? Rain out some jewelry. You know that weird shit. You know, when you on that level and you doing that, nigga, you better have that. Like, you, you know what I'm saying? You know, it's just, uh, it was just like, you know, it was like a, 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 a memory that I would never forget, bro. An experience that I would never forget. And I will always thank God for that. It was just like, just being around Ross. And just, just it was just like a. I can't explain it, bro. No, I really yeah, can't. It's, I can't it's, it's like yeah, it's something that you can't explain. It was just something that that was meant for me and and my experience from from being shot up, losing both parents, and it was like everything was just adding up to me. Like damn, is this what's God? Why is God like showing me all of this? And when you know, it, it's it's like a it's like dang, like I, I, I'm this is what I'm meant for to do. Because it's, it's like, you know what it's I'm saying? Hard. It's like, what is it? What is it? Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, it's, it's, it's just a question. But you, know you I mean? are picked. Yeah, you it's just a picked. question, though. But you Everybody still, not doing what you doing, Yeah, bro. but it's a question that you're still going to have. Because you like, bro, you got to explain. That. That's cool that you're doing that. It's cool that I'm doing that. But it's at, at the same time, it's like, damn, bro, like, my life, my my, my upbringing was like, real, like real different and tough and like not understanding. Like it's cool that I'm doing this and I and I love it, but it's like, damn, what is this about? You know well, what I'm saying? You got a, you know you what I'm got a dad. It made Eva you the person that you, you are got, today. Yeah, and you got you, big, know what I'm you got Bo, Uncle Bolo and 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 that, your dad, Eva yeah. Al. Yeah. That they they left a legacy out here yeah. for you. That's Almost one thing. Definitely. That's hard, bro. Almost definitely. That's and, hard. And most definitely. That's hard. I was just I just put out yeah. today about. Uh, Shorty Low uh, Junior, he be here a lot. Shorty Low son, Shorty Low, and I deal with uh, uh, I be linking up with Pimp C's son. Yeah, you know, like the ones who done passed on, yeah. and and it's just something about them trying to make sure they create the right legacy mm-hmm. to leave behind. You know, the, because you carrying the torch for your dad, really. Mm-hmm. And you know, maybe he did end up in a situation where he got killed and went through these different things. But look at you, 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 what he would. Would have wanted to you to be the things you're doing is not normal, bro. It's above, not, bro. That's and why I beyond. be praying. I I be like trying to understand like what it is because so so basically, um, let me tell you this real quick. So basically, it's this. Shout out to Gail. She's like a uh, so my Gail is this woman, not this woman. She's a woman that uh, my father grew up with. Okay, and um, you know. From you know she you know um, after my mother passed you know what I'm saying she felt she helped, she, my, she was like my my father's like childhood girl okay pretty much and 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 then my father cheated on her and when my mom had me okay so when my mom passed away she always felt like a mother to me and then when my father passed away she even felt even more like a mother to wow. me right so this is true story right and and shout out to Gail Gail. And Snoop Dogg mom are best friends, right? Okay. Best friends. Like, I'm talking about, like, since they was kids. So, um, Snoop Dogg, and shout out to Snoop, Uncle Snoop, Snoop Dogg, um, and rest in peace to his mom. His mother just passed away. I know. Not too long ago. I got right? the call. I okay. to talk to him. Okay, so his mother passed away not too long ago. And shout out to Bing, um, Snoop brother Bing. Shout out to Bing. And um, just I just found out that, like, that's a relationship that I honestly about to build with Snoop because... Gail is a mother to me to this day. Like she like calls me every day, check up on me. This is like my father's childhood girl. Like she like type that you know type of stuff. So she looks at me more like a son because you know my mother got killed when I was three, and my father got killed later on. So she like he don't really have. So she really look at me as her son. You don't know one. Yeah, got. you get what I'm saying. Yeah, and her Snoop Dogg mom, her Snoop Dogg mom are best friends. Like wow. literally since like day one. 
That's hard. So like, Snoop is like her nephew. Yeah, 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 yeah. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like that's her like Snoop. Yeah. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. So we never got a chance to, so I was just with in Miami with uh, Snoop, younger brother and Bing, and me and him was just building and um, stuff like that. So, you know, I, I, I have plans on, you know. Working with Snoop. Yeah, 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 plans on working with Snoop and shit, stuff like that. And um, That's yeah. hard. I yeah. want to talk about the Spot em, Got em, uh, Oh, Spot em, got em. It's like you linking up with Spot em, Got em. Um And then we got to talk about the Sean Kingston, too, because I got the Sean Kingston record. Yeah. I to my brother, yeah, Sean. that's hard. So, yeah. so this is a, give me an understanding on how you, because you guys got a video. I seen yeah. that video. Oops. I'm kind of oh. mad oh. at you because you, none of these videos are out. No, you no, just no, 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 no. Let me tell you that. And, and, and my bro right here, he, 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 he be tight about this shit because I got so much music and it's not out. So, basically... And shout out to Legacy Records. So today I just spoke to the um, the um, the lawyer, and the thing is, what it was. See, I did a lot of music with the label that I was with, and then I, I had a year contract, and I got out of my contract. So I, I I did a lot of music. So now that I'm out of my contract, you know they don't got like you know, and I don't like to too much to all my business, but you know they don't got like my masters and percentage. So them putting money into anything, it don't make no sense. Like it's like then you're not even with us no more. Yeah. So I, I had to make a negotiated. Okay, I give y'all a little percentage of you know some of my masters yeah, or something I like did. that. You get what I'm saying? So 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 boom. So that's what we did today. We just did this today. So I'm about to put out that spot. I'm got him shit. I'm about to put out a spot. I'm got him song. December, like the first two weeks of December, I'm about to put it out. Okay. Okay. So I'm about to put out the spot I'm got him joint. I got a song called, I'm gonna shoot it, I'm gonna show you before I leave. It's called uh Untold Stories. I shot a video while I was in Greece. I had a show in Greece. Wow. So I done traveled the world too. I didn't even even get into all, but there's so much shit I could talk about. So I, I went, went to I just, Greece. Yeah, I went to Greece. I had a show out, sold out show in Greece. I shot a video while I was in Greece called Untold Stories. It's crazy. I'm gonna show you the video. It's unbelievable. Um Visuals. How do you, yeah. how do you put these people together to do it? You just contact people while bro, you're there. I was built for this, bro. No, it's like, it's not even, okay, I'm gonna do a video yeah. in Greece. You don't just do a video in Greece without I the people. I wanted to take this nigga to Greece. Right? Look, this, look, first of all, like, who the hell you know in Greece, bro? I, it was they reached out to <laughs> just people that's there. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm just getting over a cold too, y'all. It's okay. They, it was people um, that was there. So, so I have a song with Sean Kingston called "Hold Up." Is fire. I felt like it was a hit. Anyway. I don't feel like we went by it the right way, but it's called Hold Up. There so, he is, yeah, me and Sean right there. Where's Sean at? Where? Right there by me and T.I. Oh, Young Kingston. Yeah, yeah. Young Kingston. That was the same day that the Migos and them got into it when oh, we was in Vegas. They got I was there. In Vegas, they did. <laughs> we they was there. Did. They I be did. on it. I was there. You're. Mm. <laughs> Shout that day, Kingston. Yeah, that they, happened right after yeah, that. Yeah, they did get into it, Kingston. Yeah, yeah, they did, they did. But 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 I, I know Kingston, and, and I know Kingston. I know his heart. He got a big heart. Kingston got a big heart, and I know that he's not feeling cool about that takeoff situation. Kingston got the biggest heart. Shout out to Mama Kingston Man. too. Mama Kingston, I love you. Shout out to Mama Kingston. Shout out to the whole Kingston family. That's my family right there, man. Them, that's my so, Jamaican. Man. I want to hear about. Um, what did you think about like the rappers? We've lost PMB Rock. We've lost PMB Dolph. Rock. We've Duh. lost uh, uh, Takeoff. Take we've lost uh, all kind of people. King Von. We caught King Von. We Pop lost Smoke. Pop Smoke. We've uh, lost uh, the, the guys. See, the one with French Montana. Uh, 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 it was the one with French Montana. The guy that was uh, C C C C <coughs> Tinks. Okay. All of these guys, huh? Chase Judge. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we lost a lot of good people, yeah. man. Yeah. Um, yeah. and I know you you've been shot five times. Yeah. Um, you could have been gone. Definitely could have been gone a long time ago. But you still here. Yeah. What do you yeah. think when you hear all these stories of everybody passing away like this, getting killed? You know, moving different, people dropping locations. Your your city, Roscoe's. People checking in, and when they check in, it don't really matter because they're getting checked out as soon as they check in. <laughs> I don't mean to laugh at that, because but it's the <laughs> truth. Yeah. Um, I feel like, you know, safety is a thing that we got to consider, you know, um, at these different places. we got to, we got to start, um, as artists, as, um, entrepreneurs, shit, not even as artists, as yeah, entrepreneurs, anybody. yeah, anybody that's about Hell, I walk any type of business, anybody, I think we about up. to, I think, I think tapping in with some type of security is going to be like a real big thing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I feel like, man, get you some real security. Some real. This is when the security going to start, you know, 
You, you can't. You, you, got, you got to get you some type of security. That's, that's how yeah, I feel. No, that's. No. I think if you got you some type of security, bro. I do. Um, I think that's gonna be a big thing. Gotta get it. Yeah. Gotta have it. Gotta be. It gotta be something that's real yeah. too. It can't yeah. be your homeboy. No, none of that boy. No, shit. it gotta be the real deal, holy feel. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So some armed security. Some, some guys security that got people a real, don't do uh, it. A real, a real business. What they they got? They got. Ex, yeah, they yeah. got ex. Uh, one of my closest friends. Uh, he has a, a, a security business, but he got ex cops working for his. Uh, yeah, this you know yeah. what I'm saying. Yeah. Off duty police yeah. officers. I mean, you got to do what you got to do. Yeah, protect yourself. You know what no, I'm saying. You, you, you know what I mean. You, you really right. You know, you're and, so and I, right. And I don't think there's nothing wrong with that. Some people want to say, "Oh, you gotta listen." They, man. Every time my six nine had all them dang protection but guess with what? him. Six nine smart. He six keep nine. them with it. Six <laughs> nine. <laughs> Come on, <laughs> six <laughs> nine. I mean, we we can talk about six nine right now. Six nine got. He got security And he's smart What is you talking about Y'all can it. say what y'all want About that kid he That got kid it. is smart He's smart He can go anywhere he, and he, Yeah He gonna pay for the security too Yeah You didn't you know, see when he was doing Michael Jackson He was dancing He was dancing around his security <laughs> He like He, he clowning But he like Yeah I got security boy You know what I mean Yeah he's Big arm guard On they arm They big He like yo You ain't about to Do what you about to do These dudes You ain't about to You know yeah, he, he and he putting up the bag. Yep. He got his security, bro. No, that's real. You know what I'm saying? You gotta have it, man. Um, yeah. uh, w- but let me let me get back to Spot Let's him because we didn't, really oh, give, him, we didn't my, give him a lot. You first know? of all, shout out to my brother Spot him. And one thing I, I want to meet him. First of all, I'm about to tell you. So first of all, shout out to my brother Spot him. One thing about Spot him, got him. He got the uh, a real organic. Following, you gotta understand that beatbox record was one of the, that was like the Whoa. biggest record Whoa. ever on tick. First of all, on TikTok, okay, ain't, ain't no song beat that record on TikTok. No, I don't, I, I don't know what's the the numbers and percentages are, but when it comes to that, yeah, they did this, that, didn't they? Jumbo, Jumbo <laughs> on that home. Jumbo on it that home. This? They were on it. Yeah, they, 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 I don't think nothing on TikTok will ever, ever, ever break that. You know what I'm uh, saying? Yeah, so he got a real organic um, following. You know what I'm yeah, saying? So yeah, t- yeah. And, and, and Spotman will always be, he gonna always, it's just when you, when you got them type of dudes that do stuff like that, it's different. So um, shout out to my brother Spotman. Um, How know, did y'all pick to where y'all was gonna do that that? No, uh, so I had video. a song called Oops. I wrote the song. So I, I, you know, the song be like, oops, that's your bitch. Oops, that's my bad. Oops. Got a new whip, skirt, the my tags, hey. oops, got a new plug, yeah. So it's called Oops, and it was like more like, it was real TikTok-ish, and I, I, I did the song while I was in Arizona, and then my I had my boy from Florida. I always had like a Florida thing about me, maybe because I'm Haitian or something like that, yeah, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you know I got songs with Raw, Sean yeah, King, Stan, yeah, yeah. Spider, they all from Florida. Yeah, you know yeah, I mean? yeah, that's hard. So it's like a Florida thing with me. Yeah, I don't yeah. know why, but it's like a Florida your wave roots? with me. It's your, your yeah, so, so it's always been like a Florida thing. So yeah. um, I was roots. like, yo, I want to get um, spot him on this record. And then um, shout out to Navarro. Navarro gave um, Spot him, got him his deal. He got him his deal, like the lawyer. Okay. So I know Navarro. He's from Jersey. Okay. So Navarro's like, yeah, I'm the one who, who gave, gave, gave his producer, the, the, who made the beatbox record. He's like, I'm the one who gave him the deal. He's like, you want to get him on the record? I'm like, yeah. Sent him over the song. And that's how it happened. And ever since then, he came out to Vegas. And we was, bro, that's my little brother. I love the shit out that nigga, man. That's like my little twin. Y'all killing him. He's he short. He's he, he short than the motherfucker. He not yeah, that like, short. Yeah, he's short. Yeah, he's short. He, he, little. he, he real small. Little. Yeah, he real so, little. So when he, when he put the song out, he was only like 18, 19. He, he, he couldn't even perform the song in a lot of places because he wasn't 21. Because mm. when he came out to Vegas to shoot the video with me, he couldn't even, he had the number one song in the world and he couldn't even perform it in Vegas because he wasn't 21. He was mm. mad as hell. Wow. It was mad. I can imagine. Imagine having the biggest record in the world and you can't even perform it because you're not even 21. He had the biggest song in the world. Oh, I know that. That song went. The Shout out to Sean song. Cotton, uh, Say Cheese, who basically uh, gave the story on him. I remember we talked to Sean about him getting yeah, shot. Yeah, he I, I, got I, shot. I, I wasn't feeling that. He talking about all the snitch shit and all that. I wasn't feeling when? that. When? When? Oh, uh, yeah. What's the, that's the name? Sean Cotton? Mm-hmm. Yeah, Say Cheese. I mean, Sean Cotton, hey, that ain't what you, I'm not with that. I'm just being, I'm just keeping it real. I'm not, what, I didn't, what I didn't, was the snitch I, didn't, thing? I don't you like that, me, though. What, what because he about? was doing, he was, he, he know what he talking, he know what I'm talking about. Yeah, I, I don't like that. No, he, you, you talking like he likes some, like, bro, you, you're not even a street. Like don't even 
Like, don't speak on I shit like that. Talking about. I know you don't know what I'm talking about. Uh-uh. He know what I'm talking about. It's cool. Okay. But I'm just saying. I'm, I, and that's cool. I'm, 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 I don't like that. I don't like yeah. that. Don't, I'm, I, that's to anybody, bro. If you're not no street nigga like that, bro, I don't want to be speaking on nothing. Like, if you don't read no paperwork, you don't know no accurate things, bro. Cause I you do know what you're talking about now. You don't, you don't, I, don't, I don't like that, bro. Like, it don't we matter, talked about bro. the paperwork matter, on here. Yeah, yeah, but it don't even matter. Like, it, it's like, bro, like, at the end of the day, bro, you're not even no street nigga like that. You ain't, who are you? Let's read your paperwork and your background, nigga. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, stop trying to, like, get in shit that you not even mix with, nigga. Like, that's like, that's like, it, you just leave that alone, bro. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't care about none of that. I'm a, I'm a real one, bro. Like, I'm, a, I'm one of them, one of them. I'm one of them, for so, real. So, when you, know you I mean? when you, when you met with Spot em Got em, so That's my little bro. When when he he had gotten shot coming from the yeah, studio, yeah, he been shot like he been but shot. But you up, was yeah. able to relate to him because you've been yeah, through I've been so much. Yeah, been shot up too. How yeah. crazy is that? A lot of time when you meet different people who've been through life experiences, how, you able to relate to him. That, that, he didn't that, even know I've been but shot that draw up like for that. A, that draws for a bun though because yeah. you're able to understand how he how he think about different things that transpire. Yeah, I understand, man, 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 man. As as just black people and just people as, bro, we come we come from f- messed up environments. Unfortunate situations and making up, making it up out of them situations, you know, as a dude like Spot, I'm just blowing up so fast and a little dude like bro, I, I, I cherish shit like that, man. That, like that's like like bro, like you made it up out of out of out of, out of, you, out of your situation, bro. Yeah, and to, to to like just become who you are that fast, bro. Like I cherish, I cherish my people, bro. I love my people. I'm not a person that's like about, uh, you know. Beat my people down or like breaking them down, bro. Yeah, I like people don't like energy. to show people don't like to show love. They hate and that's they so tearing niggas down fast, yeah. bro. And they talk shit, it. yeah, bro. Like that shit whack, bro. That shit gotta stop, a lot of bro. Be jealousy, but you yeah, gotta understand. Bro, that gotta stop, Cain bro. killed Abel for nothing. Jealousy is a dangerous thing. Yeah, you ain't gonna. It's gonna happen. It's a, it's a whole lot of other loving brother stories too that 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 did get told. But they tell us that story for a reason because they want us to turn us against each other. Real so talk. That's why they say Cain and Abel because they want to inflict and have that systematic shit that he's speaking about. We got to be the ones to stop that. That's we real. Gotta be the ones who, who who make different stories. To help Sean and bully. And then and talk about them, right? They had each other's back and, and uplifted each other. Look like he need to be on the damn podcast. You <laughs> you are, but hey, but you own it anyway. Well, that shit, you know, hey, no, hey, no, this no, camera right here is no, shooting right at you. You no, know what I'm saying? No, because. No, 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 on some real shit though, bro. This like, like I don't like when you see me with dudes like him, bro. Like the people that's around me, bro. Like anybody I fuck with, bro. I swear to God, they thorough, bro. Yeah, that's hard. I don't fuck with, bro. I, I, I ain't trying to say I'm just this immaculate person, but anybody that fuck with me, but you gonna be like nigga. And everybody I met from you that's been solid, like, that's and it's hard. just like that. You get what I'm that's saying? Hard. That's hard. Like I, I'm good, like. You, you, you might you might see him and see a white boy, but he quit all the the whole all, thing, all everything. You know what I'm saying? But he but he, but he keep me on my square. He, 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 yeah, but 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 he but he he, he black though. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> real talk, real talk. No, real talk. I'm serious, man. Like, bro, like it's love with me, man. Every time you see me, man, I bring love, good energy, and that's just what it is with me, man. Top three artists of all time, dead or alive, any genre. Damn. Number one. Hove. I knew you were going to say Hove because of earlier. Number two. Hove. Uh, Ross. Ross. Yeah. That's hard. You get to rock with the people you... You've yeah. been with these people. Number yeah, three. Uh, that's yeah, a tough Huh? Why would you say? Come, come real to I my know. Favorite would be. I'm gonna I, be know, a, I know. Rest people. in peace, DMX, man. Yeah, yeah X. Oh, X. See, I know why like DMX. I know why DMX. I know why. Um, I'm gonna do DMX. But why you choose? And Ross? I wanna, but, I, but I gotta put. Why you choose and, Ross? Why you choose Ross as what? number two? Okay. Why? I'm a, okay. First of all, okay. okay you, 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 we can go on all day about Ross. We love, hey, shout out to the MMG. We love Ross. You know, that's like, the first Rick Ross that we've ever had really? in our top three. Yeah. Nah. Yeah, who else said Rick Ross? Nah, you're right. Nobody else. Right. This, so that's why I'm asking. Oh, why put as a, Rick as Ross? Oh, yes. As a musician. I'm talking about, you know, I'm talking about, okay, okay, okay. He got a, bu- I, I, he got I, I would, a bunch I ne- of different I'm gonna be real true. Aspects. I probably would never see, did. he had to think about it, but you know, go ahead. I probably would never did that. Like, I would never put him as number two. If I never got a chance to like be with him, yeah, I ain't gonna lie. So just um, being next to him 
and just um, genuine dude. Yeah, yeah. Just seeing his how genuine he is, and just how uh, excuse me, creative he is, and just as a just a whole, not just a rapper, but just a just like just like everything when it comes to like everything around it. Like it's just like damn, bro. Like he made me want to be like him. Like, I'm gonna be real with you. But I gotta he's ask a, a question. You making like, me I think about be stuff like, now. Like, who he is? Like I love his spirit. The person he is, and and this is not people want to say, oh, you dick riding the nigga and all that other shit. But bro, like he's a person that I like. I want to be like. like you got to think about you know what I'm this dude. So that's why I don't know. He's I don't. I, I've been around a lot of people, and he's one of the main people. Like us, like man, I would like to. What, what to happened be to like, Gunplay? What happened to Wale? They what happened around? to Meek Mill? First of all, first of all, I, I um I met Gunplay and I met uh, Wale and I met all I met all of them. Um, they still MMG. They, Meek they, Mills, they, they, Meek Mills, not kind of is. I'm about to tell you this. I don't want to bash <laughs> Meek Mills. <laughs> See now he about to open up some shit. So 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 so, so, so. I'm about to tell you like this. I'm about to tell you like it is because I'm not worried. Well, Meek Mills, Mills no, ran no, up on six shout nine. Out to, shout out to my brother K Smith, Philly. Anyway, um, everybody I met around MMG is still MMG. Um, Gunplay. Is still loyal, still rocking with uh, Ross to this day. Um, Gunplay, uh, Wale. Wale is still MMG, still with Ross, still loyal, still still family. Rocking I with met him. the whole family, the, everybody that's MMG. Um, it's to me, I feel like, and, and this might be my, and, and whether it is what it is, it, uh, Meek Mill seemed like a person that kind of like got lit, did his thing. And felt bigger than the program type shit. Like I mean, f felt like, you know, forgetting where who put you on, mm -hmm. who put you on. This is it. I'm gonna be real with you. Who put you on, bro? Don't ever get it twisted. Who put you yeah, on? But he was hanging out no, with no, that, no, with no, that no, no, Philly no. basketball no, no, owner. I don't care I who he got with. <laughs> I don't care who he you got with. You remember that? Yeah. It's who put Ross. If it wasn't for Ross, nigga, you wouldn't even be who you are, bro. What I'm you? just, I'm just being real with you, nigga. If it wasn't for Ross. If you you wouldn't even be nowhere, bro. Everybody pat that wasn't fucking with you, bro. Like like I'm just being real with you, bro. Ross put you in a position to be where you at doing what you what you doing now, bro. What are you talking about? More topic. The people came and did something for him that Ross couldn't do. But what is he was in that, that justice act? And he was yeah. I don't know what he did. I, I'm just talking about what Ross. I don't care about loyalty. That, bro. I'm talking you about, about right. loyalty. I don't know about all that, bro. I, I'm just talking about you trying to talk about yeah, that loyalty. Yeah, like I don't, I don't know about all that, bro. I see what you saying too. My point of view, if that was me in that position. You get you get blinded by that because you're like, okay, you might have done I don't this get story, blinded by loyalty, got, bro. But then I yeah. got put in a position. You put me you on, bro. That's you family. No yeah, matter I'm, what. I don't yeah, know no about that. What, no matter me, I would never do that. You know what I mean? I'm always gonna know my roots. I'm always loyal with my people. You know yeah, I mean? yeah. But when you get people that get into the industry and they get to doing certain things, they didn't maybe they had so that It confused him. It. Maybe they were just doing business. But it maybe they never had that bond. Who? Him and, him and Rick Rouse? Him and me. Bro. I, obviously not. No. If it was able to be broken like that. No, bro. You got to understand, bro. I don't even want to too no. much do all that. They was together. Yeah, they yeah, was yeah, together. Yeah, yeah. You tripping, bro. I'm trying they to tell you, They were together all the time. You, yeah, bro. You got to say. Doing bro, Meek Mills was getting to the bag. What are you talking right. about? B making business moves. And then he made other business moves that made him venture away. No, that's real. Yeah. Do, but, but, but that's, that's not people. right. Yeah. That's real, but that's not right. 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 That's all, I, that's all I'm saying. It was real, yeah. but it was wrong. I just felt like me knowing who Ross is, you could have came at him about anything you're doing. And you could have talked to him. Hell yeah. And it wouldn't have been like that. Ross, oh, my bad. Yeah, it wouldn't just, never been that way. Just being around Ross, bro, I felt like you can, it's not, he's not a hard person to deal with, bro. He's not, bro. Like, I've been around him. I see how he is, bro. He's a very good person. Very he would want to be. Yeah, bro. He's not like a person that you won't even want to try to snake or try to mo. He's he's already who he is and did, he's who he is, bro. And that, yeah, I get You know it. what I mean? I like, it. I just don't, I, I, I don't care you what you that say. That's like, so. yeah, yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. He didn't have to do that. He can't even tell me. That's like you meeting me, like, nah, I know how Hey Sean is, bro. Yeah, like, he's not even like on. that. Yeah. You know what I mean? You can't tell me nothing, because I know how he is. He's a good dude. 
And it's like he is, and, and I don't care like, what you say. Yeah, yeah, right. And I just know I'm that. So it. something got to be just like how I went. Um, I, I saw Twenty One Savage talk about uh, Takeoff. He's I've like, bro, that. Takeoff was not a dude that you argue with. If you was arguing with Takeoff, you got to be in the wrong because Takeoff wasn't a person that you be arguing with or something yeah. like that. And, and, and that's how that's what I mean by that. Like, when you, I seen another person. When I seen Takeoff that day when I was with Sean, I didn't get pictures with Takeoff them because they was performing. They performed there. Oh, you got my big. I see. First, not to take, change the subject. You got my big brother Walker. I got a video yeah, with yeah, him yeah. too. Wa you got a video of Walker. Yeah, I got a video. Walker don't Walker. do music no more. He did it with me. I'm his twin. It's new. How long ago? Last year. That's hard because he don't do music yeah. like that no yeah, more. I got a video with Walker. Huh? Yeah, we walk off. Yeah. He don't do music <laughs> because he. I, you know, I bring that energy and I remind him of himself. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I'm, the, I'm like the I'm like the young like I'm I can and, and guess who produced the beat? Um, um, what's his name? He he won't start. He about to I'm about to sound crazy. Hold on, hold on, hold on. who hold produced on. the beat? He started all this shit. Hold on, I'm that's say, crazy. Watch this. It's gonna, he gonna say it in the beginning, and, and I'm drunk right now, so I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to tell y'all right now. Y'all gonna hear it on the phone right now over the mic right now. So this is the video with me and Walker. Me and Walker. It's called Active. It's under my old name, Alshon Moore. That's my real name, Alshon Moore. Alshon Moore. I looked that up. I did not think that. I was like. <laughs> Lex Luger. Lex Luger. Shout out, matter of fact. Lex Luger. All the bitch takes, all the turned up shit. All the, all Shout out to Lex Luger. That's crazy. Shout out to Lex Luger. He, it's the video. The video out on all streaming platforms and the song is crazy. We shot it in Brooklyn too. So I've been in New York for a long time. So we shot this in Brooklyn. That's like, hey, you see me? Like I got the New York. Uh, it's called Active. It's fire, bro. We shot it. This is my truck too. This is it. Uh, I'm upset with you because yeah. you changed your name, nigga. My real name is Alshon Martin, but no, I cause I, I was looking and I uh, seen that on like no jump. But I yeah, went away yeah, from that because yeah. I was like, that ain't him. I was like, that ain't him. Yeah. So this me and Walker. <laughs> It's hard. We shot that in Brooklyn, yeah. And you gotta Lex go Luger. into you gotta go into the reason why you change your name from oh. that. Oh, so 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 I changed. Yeah, yeah, let's talk about that real quick. So we, and then when we put the title, we could put like Alshon Martin, change his name to Hey Sean. Yeah, yeah, I, wanna, I, wanna, I got you. So um, that's gonna go. Yeah. So so basically, um, I'm gonna be real with you. Um, I changed my name because I didn't want my name. I'm gonna be real with you. Tied to the because you're a the, junior. To the, to the to the to the six nine tradeway shit and all oh, that other yeah. shit. So you had to change. Um, it. Then, you like I you just were... felt like I wanted to start off fresh. I, I didn't want Alshon Martin. I didn't want none, none of all that shit tagged to. The, you know what I'm saying? Just yeah. all that shit, bro. So and then I wanted I wanted Martin, I wanted to yeah. connect to my Haitian roots. I wanted to connect to who I am as a Haitian man in America. I wanted to, and, I, and I thought it was like dope. My name is Alshon. That's hard. So then Haitian. It's dope. It's like saying Haitian. Yeah. But Hey Sean. Yeah. But I, my name is Al Sean. But it takes big but corona it was like, to change it was your name. Like like Are you a junior? Just like your dad? Because no, your my dad, dad was, was a junior. Al. Yeah. So His real name is my, my dad name was Albert. Oh, okay. Albert Martin Jr. Oh, okay. So I, I know my mom yeah. wasn't going for that shit. <laughs> She wasn't going for that. Yeah, boy, Albert. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man. None I'm, of that shit. Listen, man, I'm, I'm going to tell you, man, I didn't know when I, when, when we did it. We go by yeah. energy, man. We didn't yeah. know. We didn't know what we was like. She yeah, told me. Yeah. She looked at She's like, yeah. But I looked at that Al. I'm so like, when you look, hold on, when you, when, I'm say, when you look up my video, so when you look up Alshon Martin, Everything no jumping, gonna pop all that stuff. Start no jumpers up. gonna pop up. I said that up. wasn't you. I was um, like, oh, hell no. Who me is six that? nine. Gonna I didn't pop even up. look. A lot of shit with me. Why six did you think it wasn't him? Because that ain't his name. I moved <laughs> on. You know yeah, what I'm yeah. saying? Alshon, Alshon. Everybody know me as Alshon Martin. I'm, I'm that's the dude crazy. that's from South Central. But like I said, I, I, I'm in New York now. I've been in New York for like seven years, and the, and I ain't been back to LA because um, I got out of LA. And it was the best thing for me. When I got to New York, you know, I got closer to my Haitian roots. There's a lot of Haitians in New York, so yeah. I was kind of good. Like, I was always, people were like, how was you floating hey, around? Um, you connect them dots, it's crazy, man, because you come so, from 
Across the yeah, so a lot of people in LA be like, "How the fuck you survive in New York?" And they don't know because I'm Haitian. I'm gonna be the real, like not like that, but like when I go to Miami, like Will I'm you good. Visit? Like I love my Haitian culture. I, I'm will like, you ever go back what? to Haiti and visit? Yeah, I will, but I'm gonna go protect it. What <laughs> the hell? We we interviewed a what was he a prime minister or something? He was or running president? to be a prime minister from Haiti. From Haiti. Yeah, Clef actually ran for a uh, white Clef ran for Haiti. Um, years ago, long time I ago. Why you. didn't he win? He should have won, man. Um, so, dude, you've he, been doing this he, a long um, time, bro. You've been in this stuff a lot. Yeah, he he. Um, I no. usually spend uh, Thanksgiving with Clef. He do. He bring the fuck the whole Haiti you, to his house. You deal with a lot of different yeah. different people, man. You've dealt with so much, man. Yeah. It's crazy. Yeah, man. But you still here. I love the fact that you still here. I keep thinking about yeah. that because you're dealing with a lot of different spirits in a lot of different places, mm -hmm. and, and this entertainment thing can be funny sometimes. Yeah, but, but but I'm not really in it for the entertainment or nothing But like it's that. there. Just, like, it's there, but, you know, um, I, I feel like if one of these records catch, they catch. If they don't, then I'll just be having fun. Yeah. Keep doing it for the love of yeah, music. Oh, I don't, don't want to. Wrote a song about it. That's hard. <laughs> yeah. That's hard. You have a family? Like, um, is it who's your son? No, I don't got, I don't got, I no don't, I don't wife, have, kids, no, none of that. I don't, I mean, I got a son. Um, how old so is far. he? Uh, he's three. I'm teaching oh, okay. the importance uh, of that right now, man. Yeah, I'm, that's I got, hard. You got a lot I don't really with. have, um, family. I'm like a, like this nigga here is my family. That's like, if I, if I wasn't. Yeah, I wouldn't even be here because would, you don't know I your dad's side of the family. I wouldn't be here nobody. if it wasn't even for him. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you don't yeah. come from a household, right? I know what I had to ask you, man. Right. You know what structure is, bro. You've never been in a house like that. You don't come from a house like that. Right. Hey, sure. I had to think about that. You know like, what the hell made you like Boss Talk One Hundred and One? Because you know, you know you what it was. He, he reached, he out. reached um, out. What the hell I, was it? I saw a clip. And I was on um, what do you call, what do you call when when the um when you watch um Instagram and it's on the um, explore page, or explore, explore page. Page. Oh, a real oh, a real popped up, and that's, uh, a, <coughs> that's you, mm -hmm. a real popped up, and um who was it? Somebody, you you Probably were talking. me of course talking. That's what I do. You were talking on this side of the table, and I was like. Here's oh, the <laughs> It was a it was a real question. It was real, and somebody explained and, and responded, and I was just like, "Damn!" It, it was like you know how you ask a question, and some people might not give you that. It was like one of them like real nigga moments. Like, yeah, yeah it might have been Hot Boy hard. West. Was and it Hot Boy West? He watched it fifty times back to back. Yeah, for real, like, that's Damn. hard. Man. I was like, "Thank you so much." You know what I'm saying, man? I so, love it. I love me. I, like, we ain't working in vain, babe. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Man, we trying yeah. to do something oh, real. Design. Yeah, that's how. I have that's how. I, this it, how I be every time too. It's just real. Yeah. It's just about the people I'm dealing with. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. and, and I make it that way purposely yeah. because it means more when it's intimate. It mm -hmm. is a conversation. It's a mm -hmm. very good conversation too. It we was, have, was, this go. This is a great interview, man. Yeah. yeah. Everything I learned about you, I didn't know none of that stuff. A lot of it, like I said. I've seen that page though, yeah. but I didn't look at it. Cause I, I was, that is not that nigga, man. He like, nah. he like to find out everything yeah, on out, here son. so that it yeah. will be it, more, it's organic. more organic. Yeah, I'm, out, I'm out, Sean Martin. Um, like I say, uh, you know, um, everybody know me from the, um, you know, what I like I said, I got discovered from the um, little six nine situation, and uh, I brought him. The Crips and the Bloods came together in L.A. Was like, we don't so, want this nigga in L.A. And me being from Hoover. Hoover, we like the most hated gang in LA. Mm -hmm. So I was like, Crips and Bloods, nigga, it is what it is. We don't get along with neither one of y'all anyway, so he cool with me. So what it is, like, you know, this check in shit, well, he fuck with me, he already checked in then. So if y'all, if wow. we talking, checking in, I don't know what y'all mean by that, but if he fucking with me, who he gotta check in with? And you know what I'm saying? That's what that is. I'm just trying to figure out, I'm just trying to figure out like who he got to check in with if he fucking he with, with me. You, yeah. Oh, so no. is you evil ass? So yeah. Like what is you? What is Bolo you? Bolo nephew. Nigga, stop playing. Stop playing. Nigga, Bolo nephew. Yeah. Who, 
Who you gotta check in with? See the vibe how he talked about when he reflected on 6 9 that you know, he spent time with his family and his kids. Yeah. So it was never about none of them politics. He got to know it wasn't him. about that. He got yeah. to know it. It wasn't it was about none of that shit. And so while like, y'all trying to throw that shit at us, we like, nigga, like, what is y'all he, talking he about? For the man, he know, he know who his soul is. You know what I'm saying? And look what 6 9 do with his money. He always out. He he got, he bro, bro, yeah, yeah, bro, bro. Yeah, it's not about that. Ain't no game. Y'all doing all this extra shit. We not even about what that is y'all shit talking about. What is y'all talking about? We not uh, even on that. And and that and it is what it is. That's why God I'm standing God. on that. Yeah, like and that's the way it be, man. Like I said, man, I'm gonna tell you first of all, thank you again for coming yeah. on the show, man. How can people reach you if they're trying to link with you to do man, some business, I'm, man? Hey, Sean Martin. Um, that's H A I S H A W N Martin on Instagram. And right now, bro, I'm gonna be real with you. If you, I don't really. Want to collab with nobody? I'm just being real with you, not like that. Like because you not gonna, you not gonna want to fuck with me because I want to tell you some crazy ass number, bro. And I don't really need nothing from you. It's not about the money. No, it's not, it's not about none of that shit, no. bro. I gotta fuck with you. Like if I, if you might introduce me to somebody, we can work on a personal. Yeah, 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 yeah. But it's not about money with no. me or nothing like that because I'm already doing what I'm supposed it to be doing. Be right. You get what I'm saying? It yeah. Right. Gotta, the it relationship gotta, gotta, gotta be, be tight. Money. It, it don't gotta be, right. be about none of the money. Shit. It's yeah. not about the money shit. My niggas is getting money. They got car businesses and Bro. we got we traveling and we, we we about to set up tours. I'm about to drop some shit with Ross and March. I'm gonna drop my album. Bro. Me and Spider I got a I got a Twitter campaign. I'm I, coming I got a, to a, New York to do my first I don't New York. Nothing layup. from nobody. I'm coming. Bro. I'm, I'm bringing <laughs> Boss Talk to New York and I'm coming yeah. to this nigga yeah. right here. Yeah, let's do it. Let's I'm take it to it. another I'm level. I always do it. Let's go. I've been to Cali like four times. Nah, let's go. Let's go. It's hard up there. What's up there? Isn't that country? She said, she she says, huh? Is it country? Is it country? What? Nigga, I'm country. Let's go. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You is country. I'm country as hell, nigga. I love it. Yeah, I love country my ass, too. I do, yeah. I do. Y'all country people are my people, man. I'm country. You see Jamaican, I'm country. Oh, okay, okay. He country, I'm, I'm seeing. I'm fucking with Jamaicans. I call Sean Kingston right now. Hey, Mama Kingston and all of them are my peoples. Yeah, yeah we met him that day. She, she was excited country. about that. She said, it's St. Paul country. It ain't country at all. <laughs> I'll tell you that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, now, let me tell you something. Minnesota? No. Our country. Cold than a motherfucker. Y'all don't do that. Don't bring your summertime. country. No, don't bring your summer. country no, ass down to Minnesota. They're gonna yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. They going to freeze your country. I went to Chicago. I went to Chicago. What that? Two, three, two, three, three, about three years your ago. It was cold as hell. <laughs> I lift up. I say, hell no. Nah. The ice was water thick, like the thick water on top. Yeah, that's yeah. The ice was that's on top. Out here. Bro, you I got it. the. It was snowing, wasn't it? Mm. I said, baby, we got to get the hell out of up yeah. here, bro. Yeah. They tripping in Chicago. It's, oh yeah, yeah. That's yeah. what it is. Many but in, in and, and, and yeah. where he from, though? But I ain't gonna lie. In Minnesota, it's cold, bro. It's colder than New York, Chicago, no, all that is? shit. I really? swear to God, yeah. it's freezing out cold, there. Cold, cold. It's freezing, bro. It's a different type of cold. Yo, your body tensed up the whole time while you in there. The best months to go is what? Probably June and July. In the summer, though, it's cracking. But it's a lot of money out there. Cracking. I bet. It's a lot, it's of, a money. lot of money lot out of there. Speed. You actually need to go out there and, and get your pot and, and get like boss talk going just because oh. it's a lot of artists. It's a lot of money out there. You just need to you need to you need to go on a, a boss talk tour. What I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go on a boss talk tour. I'm gonna set up and then you just need bring to go on people in and let them see a live setting like you, us. Yeah, yeah. We've been many places. We've been to L. A. We've been to Chicago. I'm in the L. A. Months out Vegas. Arizona? No, we didn't stop down oh, there. Oh, y'all the AZ. Oh, y'all tripping. Yo, what are you doing? Go to because AZ. we got to have to connect. Right. We you have to have. You don't have love AZ. I you been, don't love it. I don't stop for the no bars. The city no, that we go to. That. It's a lot of artists out there. The city we got to go to is we have to have the connect to stop there to say, who are we going to interview? I'm about to hit you, bro. I'm about to help. I want to help you expand whatever you want to go. I like to go. I'll go. I just pull up. I want to get involved in Boss Talk, man. Man, let's do it. I want to get involved, man. Yeah. I, 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 I like what y'all doing. Man, we be chilling, though. Yeah, yeah. On the set, it's the yeah. same, you know? Yeah. It's the same, nigga. We here. Yeah. yeah. It's just like this. Yeah. Real <laughs> shit. I love, I love what y'all hey, got going man. on, man. Hey, it's no, a good vibe. I love y'all, man. Y'all. Man, we better shut this down, yeah. now. Yeah, man, we love you, bro. I love y'all. Man, hey, yeah. Sean, man. I love y'all. Me and my wife, you love. always, when you, you, we coming to you next, though. We coming to New York. Come on. I already been planning it, right? Yeah, because we never been. 
We Never been we, with Boss Talk. Yeah, Boss Talk. We've been a lot we of times. We said we going to go Boss hit up Jim Jones and all them All the boys you see on that wall. It's going down. Yeah, it's going down. Yes, sir. Hey, man, check it, man. It's been another great segment, man, of Boss Talk 101, where the bosses talk. And we out.